What's up, y'all? It's your boy, Black Owl, and welcome back to another episode of Cooking with Black Owl. Today, I'm going to show you how to make some cool, creamy corn dip. Sometimes called Mexican corn dip, sometimes called the cowboy corn dip. I'll tell you what I'm going to call it and what I want to call it. Done. So let's get do it, buddy. That's right, baby, the corn dip. And I ain't talking about that children of the corn either, Malachi. Y'all ever seen that movie? He wants you to, Malachi. He wants you to. Oh, spooky. Gave me the willy. So, we ain't talking about none of that scary stuff. We're talking about some good, 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 good. So, corn dip. And you're saying yourself, like, oh, where'd you get your corn? I know you, you old cheap bastard. Did you go to the store and get it out of the can? No, I didn't. I actually went full farmer friend on that shit. And I got my corn fresh out of my own garden, and I'm rather proud of it. So, I went ahead and took that corn. The first thing that you got to do when you get some fresh corn, you got to take the husk off there, the husky. Kind of like the pants I used to wear in middle school, you know. <laughs> Not much has changed. So, you take that green off there, and then you got a little, uh, I don't know what to call them per se. There's probably a proper term for them, but I like to think of them as the wild hairs, you know, because I got one myself right here, so... Oh, Lord, that mango is so good. So, take your corn, pull the husk off, take the hairs off, and then I want you to take it to the sink and wash it off because it has been outside for quite a time. So, then I want you to go ahead and get you some green onions. And I didn't say green acres because green acres is the place for me, but you want some of that green onion in there, sir, just to kind of give it a little zest, if you will. Because, you know, the whole thing about this thing is, it's a cool little summer dip, and it's it's the continuation of my summer dip series. And you know, y'all are lucky right now because it's about 110 degrees outside, and I wish I was in here cooking in the nude like a full Monty. So, next thing that you got to do once you got your green onions and your corn done, I want you to get some turkey. And you're saying to yourself, Black Owl, turkey and corn dip? How did that ever come about? Well, I'm going to tell you what. To me, a meal is not a meal without no meat. And you're saying, like, oh, isn't that just dip? Well, psh, if I'm making it, I'm going to make it a meal. You know what I'm talking about? Because I ain't got that bread like E-40. I've just got a simple man's pay. But I did have some turkey in the fridge. Went ahead and cut it up. And you know, I didn't want to make old Sling Blade mad if he came over here and say, ain't got no meat in it. Mm -hmm. So we went ahead and cut that turkey up and we put it down in there. Next thing that we did, we got some shredded cheddar cheese, that Belbita. And we put that sucker in there too, boy. Now, you're saying to yourself, like, oh, could you go ahead and shred some uh, shredded cheese of your own? Could you get a block of cheese and get that grater and get to mixing and moving and grooving? Well, sure, you could. But you know me, baby, and you know what I'm going to say. So say it with me. I can time for that shit. So, went ahead and put that shredded cheese right on top. Now, you've got the corn, you've got the green onions, you've got the dirt, all in there. Mix it good. Good. Then, I want you to go ahead and get some whipped dressing, you know. You can use Miracle Whip, you can use mayonnaise. I've seen some people use ranch, but to me, we are going to whip it like Devo. So, go ahead and put that down in there too. We're going to give it a good, generous stir. And you know, that's the beautiful thing about this. Quick, easy, good. So, our dip is done. I want you to take it over to the refrigerator, the fridge, like that dude that used to play with the bears. And let it cool, baby. Let it cool down because you want that cool. And this thing, man, you know, it's hot as hell outside. You want that cool, sweet, sweet treat. So let it cool down. We're going to come back. We're going to have a sight. We're going to have a bite of this beautiful corn dip tonight. And you know what's right. Wow. Cannot wait, cannot wait, cannot wait. All right, baby, the time has come. The corn dip is done. And I'm having the first big bite for this big hunk of man right here. Hunk of hunk of burning love. <laughs> so, you're saying yourself like, oh, 
what kind of uh, chips you got to put in the dip tonight? Well, I went down Old Memory Lane. I haven't had these in a long time. Fritos scoops. I figure corn dip, corn chip. And the thing about this is, you know, Punch, if you watch my brother, I'm going to tell the story of my brother. <laughs> this man, he used to eat these things without any dip. This, he lived off this and SpaghettiOs. You could make that man a Christmas dinner with all the trimmings. He just wants scoops and SpaghettiOs. So, I think he's grown out of that now, but I think he still really likes them both. So, Punch, this dips for you. And for me, too. Brotherly love. So, let's get a big old dip. I like Heavy duty, sir. And that's the great thing about these scoops. They are made for dipping. They're powerful, baby. Yeah. Excuse me. Oh! That's delicious, baby. That corn in there and the green onion give you a nice vegetable feel. But then, you got the cool cheese, the whipped topping, and then turkey just really sets it off, man. I almost feel like you could get a tortilla and make a little wrap out of this deal, but might do that later after a few more of these mangoes. So, I first of all, before I get there, because <laughs> y'all want to see that, ooh, I want to thank all of y'all for watching another episode of Cooking with Black Hour. Make sure to like and subscribe and follow me on social media. Now, you can watch all my other cooking videos right here on my YouTube channel. Y'all have a good one. Enjoy that dip. Enjoy that drink. I know I will. I love you all. And I will see you next time. Pardon me. I'm so good I just want to stick a hand in there and get a handful of it. <laughs> but I get manners some. At least while I'm on camera.